I'm going to be attempting to make horse treats. I have a broken arm, so we'll see. Okay. Uh, so my arm is... I mean, I can't... I really shouldn't pick anything up with it. I still have about three weeks until I get the cast off. We're going to take three cups of oatmeal, like uncooked oatmeal. So just to let you know, our house is being remodeled. So if you hear any like hammering or screaming, just like don't freak out. We're going to do a half cup of flour. I don't know if I should do a bendy one or a metal one. Maybe a wood one. I'll go with wood. Beautiful. One fourth cup of honey. And of course it's not here. How many tablespoons? Okay, probably don't want to do that. Use this one. Okay, why does this only go to half cup? Okay, I can't do that, okay. One cup of applesauce. Okay. So, what did I tell you? Okay, yeah, comment down below. What's your f horse's favorite flavor of treats? Legend doesn't really like sweet. He will tolerate peppermint, but he doesn't love it, like, uh, oh, he likes, his favorite treat is apples. I realize there's stuff in the oven, and I just turned on the oven, so. Alright, so luckily, cast iron does not blow up. Oh, fun story, one time my mom took something out of the oven, and <laughs> put it on the stove top, and one of the burners was on and the pan exploded and like it was glass so like if she was in there it would have killed her great story don't do that it's dangerous and it would probably be a very painful death so do i have any internet best friends no i don't think well I have internet friends, I would say. What state do you live in? I live in Kentucky. It, not the like horse part of Kentucky, but like the hillbilly part of Kentucky. Ah, okay. I live like where Tennessee and Kentucky and Virginia meet. And my barn is in Virginia. Put a little bit more honey. I don't know, maybe not that much. Okay. Your, what is your opinion on quarter horses? And do you think they are a good first horse? I love them. I think they're great. Legend was my first horse, but I would not put a... I mean, I'm not gonna... I wasn't advanced in any kind of way when I bought them, but... And I'm not saying I'm an amazing rider, but just because he scares me so bad, I would. I wouldn't feel comfortable putting a beginner on him. He was definitely, I like, I wouldn't have traded him for any other words because he was a, he taught me so much. Even though he scared me so much every time I got on him. What does your dream horse look like? Um, a dark bay. Probably about 16 hands. I don't know, like, I love the way Oldenburg's look. Okay, it's still really dry, so I'm just going to add applesauce. Mm, I put half the jar, but that's fine. So yeah, how did you grow your YouTube channel? I can't really say that it's really big, but I guess it's not tiny for an equestrian channel. I don't know. Just be polite to everybody and yeah. Mm -hmm. I don't really have any other an answers. I'm going to try to put some of this in. How tall are you? I am a 5'4". Would you ever buy another horse to ride? 
Yes, sure. Okay, I feel like this is going nowhere. It's just goo now. So, I'm going to try to add a little bit more oil mill. <laughs> I don't know, maybe I should add more honey, but I'm kind of scared at this point. I feel like I should just go with this and hope for the best. But, I never follow my gut feeling, so. I'm gonna put a little bit more honey. And now I'm really hurting my arm and I need to set this down. Okay. Siblings do you have? I have eight siblings. Too many, if you ask me, but oh well. Alright, that was it for Q&A time. Alright, so I have my pan right here. I need to spend it right here. I feel like when I made this recipe like two years ago, I had a little tiny scoop. I have no idea where that would be. Everything just kind of disappeared when we remodeled the kitchen. going to use this scoop. Um, I don't do anything anymore and I kind of want to take up another hobby because that's what I do when I'm bored. So I was hoping this video was going to be a little more interesting but I feel like it's just really boring at this point and I have no idea what I'm doing. My hands are too messy to turn off the camera so. I play piano, I play violin, I took voice lessons, I took gymnastics. Um, and now I'm writing courses and I'm not taking violin this semester because I broke my arm because of horses. So now I'm just doing courses and I'm not even doing that because my arm's broken. So here I am just making horse trees because I ran out of things to do. And I haven't done school in a century because I'm homeschooled and I couldn't write for the longest time. And I can finally write, and but now I lost all motivation. And I don't have anything better to do except to make horse treats. And I don't even know why because I don't know if they're going to be good in three weeks. When I can go back. But that's fine, I'll just waste these ingredients. So, I'm going to stick these in the oven for... I don't even know how long. And then I will get back to you. So it's about 30 minutes later. And, I don't know, I think the treats turned out okay. It's not bad. Okay everyone, so thank you guys so much for watching this video. Um, yeah, just comment down below what's your horse's favorite type of treats. Legends is apples and I think dreamers are like peppermint, maybe. So, yeah, you can, you can go ahead and comment that down below. And thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you in my next video. Bye!